Good morning, Osamui. Oh, <laughs> and the gangsters are looking at me. The taxi gangsters. Body cab. You good? Body? Good. So today, <laughs> I, uh, this is a ferry port, by the way. This is where you arrive and then walk through there. So I thought I'd start my vlog today as I'm going to go around the whole island in one day. So you might have to watch this in two sittings. I, I don't know, I, I ain't started the journey. It has rained about four, five, maybe six times in the night. I got woke up a few times by the rain, some of it pretty heavy. And it hasn't rained this morning, but look. We haven't seen skies like that for some time. We really haven't. Well, I haven't. So that's a ferry just arriving, I guess, the early morning one. Good timing. So I'm going to take... Oh, mate, I'm going to make a jump. I'm going to go right and we'll see how far we get. And I'll just keep stopping along the way, uh, doing my little vlog. And we'll see how the day develops. Like I say, I've got no idea what's going to happen. I just hope it stays dry. Um, yeah, yeah, so uh, today, good morning, Koh Samui. Morning. Okay, first point of interest. I've probably done two kilometers down that road. <clears throat> there's businesses open, there's businesses shut, businesses closed down, and a little bit of apocalyptic, but not much. So it's not really worth, I didn't see anything worth stopping for, but I did see this place where I've just stopped, which is the Thai Cannabis Company, <laughs> Cannabis Menus, Beach Bar and Restaurant. Charisk, charism up, open 11 a.m. till late. Welcome to Chai Sumiri. Okay, that's what's said on the board. Chai, beach bar and restaurant. So it's not open, but I will go in. But before I go in, I just want to show you this. Look, look at that. Now that is what you call a scooter. <laughs> that is pretty cool. It's a scamondi. It's a modern day Lambretta, if you don't know. And if you wondered why I was pointing that out, it's because I like Lambrettas. And I've got one. It's the only transport I have back home is my little Lambretta. Well, I better take the boots off. Look how cool this place is, though. These little rickshaws, they're all over the place. Really old, but they're never You'll never see him in this condition. That is really good nick, man. Oh, it's, it's okay? Sorry, I make um, film. Uh, it's your car? Ah, oh, man, I, I, I mean, is that your, your scooter? No, I'm boss. Your boss scooter? Okay, oh. okay, okay. Can I, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, do you want to show me around? Oh, you go. Okay. Okay. I'll just do this and then I'll I'll come back. Okay. Later. Yeah. Okay. Cup on cap. Cheers, buddy. Yeah. Oh, cool, man. Oh man. Oh wait, 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 wait. Guy, guy said it's okay if I do a little bit of filming while we're closed here. Nice pool table all covered up. Oh man. But let me just show you what I was. Well, I was just, I, I see things out of the corner of my eye and you guys are just that way till I get there. But that is a nice chess set. And this is a cool place. And I'll show you for why, look. Oh, I like this place. I'm definitely coming back to speak to his boss. Definitely. Oh man, fine dining. <laughs> look, look at that out there. Oh man, that's a proper cocktail bar. <laughs> I shouldn't be in there while it's shut, but that cool, that guy, he did say it was alright to go around and do some filming. What a cool little spot. My first destination of the day, in my opinion, is a definite winner. <laughs> Until I get my wallet out when I come back. Fucking hell. Sorry, bloody hell. <gasps> Look at this. It's all Italian Taverstein stone. It's no cheap sandstone, that is Italian stone, which is awesome. 
and that <laughs> how cool man got these lounges oh and then the infinity pool right into the sea oh man champagne bucket over there and i do believe the sun is coming out awesome really awesome look at this man oh man the champagne buckets look at that fish <laughs> oh, man, i just like stuff like that that is just really cool really nice and if i was rich i'd have a few of them things in my small humble wooden cottage oh man so there we go somewhere i didn't i didn't know that was going to turn out like that that's why i love my job because I, I never know what I'm gonna venture upon, man. Good morning, Swaddy Cab. That was just a surprise out of surprise, and that was a wicked, wicked spot. And the only reason I stopped is because that old, not that old, that brand new looking scooter there, which does look the tits. I like it. And that's, that, that's the owner who owns that. I reckon he's got a few quid. Right then, see what else we can find. Okay, the hat is on for good reason on the bike. I don't really like wearing it, but um, also I'm gonna have to put face masks on as I have heard that the police are dishing out fines. If you haven't got a face mask or a helmet, it's a thousand baht for each, each. So, you know, it's a real pain because I really hate the face masks. I don't like them at all. Oh man, so anyway, I've stopped because I've come to the, um, the there's no signposts on the street. I've now entered what I believe is a, a yeah, Bop Hut, Bop Hut Beach. But there's no sign, I've been looking, as soon as I come to a new spot, I'm looking on the signs to see what it says. Give me a little bit of a clue so I can give you guys some information, but it's really hard work really hard work but the reason I stopped is because I'm at this junction it's, it's not really a junction it's just a really big left turn <laughs> over on the right hand side there if I can get over come on lit one pearl one for me this lady one hand in her purse he's coming this way okay so I'm out of everybody's way and I'm going I'm going down here, the fisherman's village. I don't think it's a fisherman's village. It is, okay, got a little restaurant there, little boutique shop. It's gonna be a little, what would I call it? A little coffee shop there. Oh man. Well it is, it's, it's called fisherman's village. <laughs> I hadn't seen no fisherman now, but I'm going to park there. Whenever I see no parking sign, that's where I like to park. Uh, I'm, like I told you, I'm dyslexic. So that's how that is. <laughs> I'll park here. Hang on, I'll be a good boy. There we go. Oh, so we've got another little calf there. Thai tapas. In there. They all got a little cocktail bar. Takeaway, big cup, bucket, cocktails. Cocktails. So my bet is this is a walking street. Let's call it a walking street with little shops, bars, tapas, restaurants, all kinds of stuff, man. <laughs> the Karma Deli. See, this puts me off straight away. See, they use all this shit wood and they try and make it all look rustic. <laughs> <laughs> right, you just load our crap off the side, <laughs> right? <laughs> you'll probably end up sitting down, you've got a nice top on, you'll probably pluck it on a nail or catch it with something and rip a thread and that, and um, <laughs> you gotta pay a lot more for it. What is it? Shabby chic we have in the UK. Um, <laughs> I just find it funny. I do, I do. Uh, so here we are, Fisherman's Village. Where there ain't a fisherman in sight. 
Whoa, I better walk this way. That music's a bit. I, did, I have to catch out on that, man. I just get carried away with looking. I forget to use my lugs. And now it's at Fisherman's Village. <laughs> Say it again, should I? Oh, Bo Bop Hut here. So I guess that's where we're at. at Bop Hut. And the day is looking better and better. Hmm. Okay, and there's a beach all the way along there. I guess this is Bop Hut. I've got to get a move on because like I said this this will definitely be in two parts this video because it's going to be quite a long one I guess and like I say there's more and more and more of what you want down that walking street but a lot of it looks dead okay I'm at a red light <laughs> and I'm going to turn right to Ban Nathon and Ban May Nam man <laughs> it's a red light, but there's a truck behind me and it's tooted. You know what happens there, don't you? Same as what happened in the UK. I fucking sit here, revving his motor. <laughs> Look his window down. <laughs> and he's still sitting there. Can't go anywhere because there's traffic coming from the right. Look. But he's tired, so his brain only thinks two seconds ahead. They don't take everything in to consideration. <laughs> I do. I feel good today. I do. I feel lively, refreshed. I've had some breaks off, and now we've got plenty of sun. And uh, like I say, I'll sit here <laughs> until that red light change colour. <laughs> Probably watch a couple of tourists come past and have an accident. I don't know. Like I say, you, you've got to be all about you in you don't know what's gonna happen so I'm turning right in a minute but this says I'm in May Nam and on the other side I don't know if you can see on the other side of the road but all the girly bars along there one two three four five six they all look closed as do the rest of them I'm sorry that's not this side they're on the opposite side and there's too many traffic coming so I can't drive the wrong way not on this street, that's a bit busy but there is a general pattern occurring in all these islands wherever you go in Thailand loads of businesses shut loads, you know, run down and the odd one or two so, look Open. It's pretty shit. Wherever you look, it's it's a, it's the same old thing, you know. So it's not just COVID that's done this. It's not. You can't blame that COVID for everything. What this is, all this, all these islands, they all built up far too quickly during a recession. Of, of the people who were actually coming here which was Western Europe and America in 2008 and 9 when we hit recession we stopped coming here but do you know what these Thai people did not stop building they all built get rich quick businesses which have all collapsed because they weren't really businesses in the first place were they? Tourism you know so that's why these places look the way they do and they're never good they're never going to recover not a chance you can you can forget it all the girly bars in thailand they are going they are going they are going I, i'd say this year next year you'll see all them girly bars will be gone all them bar owners all, all that it, it's going Aha. thailand is learning to become a, a real country you know you, you, you need sustainability and Thailand they, they just haven't got it and that's what I see throughout these islands um, and I am an expert it is, my, it is what I, I know most of oh man it's gone a bit cloudy 
As I was, I'm not far, I've already bored. I'm, I'm sorry guys, but I am. I'm just same old shit on this island, going around. People driving who ain't really got a lot of sense on how to drive. <laughs> You know, everybody in a rush, 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 and th th this, th that's what this is. All these little businesses, what you see, they were all built on the rush, rush, rush. All like, oh, that's a great idea. Without thinking of the 99 things that perhaps they should have done, give it a bit more thought, but they don't. I, I don't feel any sympathy to the ties whatsoever. If you're a Thai person or a, an expat and your tourism business is, I ain't got no sympathy for you at all. None. I, I really haven't. Shouldn't have built the shit places in the first place, man. It's my opinion. And now, what, the only places that are open is this, look, Cafe Amazon. Fucking mad. Anyway, I'll find something decent. Hang in there. Okay, this little strip that I've just taken, Sawyer along Com. I think I'm in the same area. There just hasn't been any beachway, this is called. <laughs> oh, let's have a look down here. But there's no, there's no let up of all the businesses whether they're open, shut, run down, never to be, whatever. There's just no, uh, there's nothing in between them. The whole street is just that. Toe parts, I don't know. Bar, but these were all closed. <laughs> Proper run down. Nah, I don't know. See, some are difficult. That one's all closed on that side. It's a shitty area as well. <laughs> I mean, it is. <laughs> oh man, yeah, all these places, they'll be shut down this little street. Except that one place in the massage place. <laughs> oh man, it's just, it's just the same old song over and over again. So that was that was that. Started to rain a little bit, so I wanna head for cover. Bang Po <coughs> Beach. Which if it was looked after and someone had a rake, it'd be quite a nice beach. Not too bad, it's clean apart from all the, the crap. That's washed up and needs to be cleaned every day. And if you own businesses along here and apartments, there's one guy up there having his little go. You know? That's all locked up, it's all abandoned, man. Oh, no way. It's a picture of Bob Marley <laughs> on a calf. I wonder if it's going to be one of them. Probably is. I bet it's open. It looks like no, nah, no one's in here. That's not open. I don't think. <gasps> Lizard. <laughs> this place. It's Bob. Bob Marley. <laughs> it's probably got to be one of them cafes. If I get in, I probably won't get out. But it looks closed. So I'm having a quick walk about and there's one guy up there, look, one decent person actually having a good sweep up, but hang on, she's sweeping it back into the sea. It's like, <laughs> just throw it back in the sea, mate. Oh, he's got his little bit here, look, and he's having a good go. That ain't too bad. Oh, it's a young lady. How are you? Yeah, good. I like to see you. You, you very good sweeping the beach. Cup on cap. Have a good day. Awesome. It's nice. Got a little massage parlor there. Look, cold drinks and stuff. Twenty cap. 
and that is really cool to see sweeping the beach all good but the rest of it it's a house there or big bungalow now that would be a cool place to rent that would be such a cool place kayaks just left about there they're like oh man even second hand they're like 200 300 quid people in thailand like i say they've got too much money far too much money well i'm now heading <clears throat> i think i'm now on the other side of the island i think i just done a loop i took a left so still got quite a bit of the island to go to see but look what i found <laughs> okay and i gotta go through a bit of snake city fucking hell man what have <laughs> caught up like this snakes are there are snakes on coast for me i don't know oh man you never know what i'm gonna put my feet into these days oh man <laughs> Abandoned Thailand. <laughs> There's always something abandoned, and it isn't just this place to my left, it's also this place to my, my other left. <laughs> to my right and my left. Right. So, what is it? What was it? It's quite some way. I thought we'd be right on the beach, so. But we're not. Oh man. Ah. Private villas. Hello. Forty cap. You what well, was this a hotel? Hotel? No. Hospital? Yeah. Hospital. For children? You don't know. <laughs> don't know. Okay, cap on cap, thank you. Ah, okay, so it wasn't a hotel. It was, I think it was perhaps a school, maybe. Oh man, oh man. <laughs> Sorry, not as exciting as I thought it would. Fuck, fuck, fuck. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I saw him fucking slipped over. Oh. <laughs> that building. Fuck! I can't believe I fell over. That was a bad slip as well. I'll try not to <laughs> think about it. Ah, grinds me knee. Oh man! I don't know if I want to go down here now. Ah! Oh, fuck! Oh man! Ah! Oh. Man, <laughs> fuck. Look at the algae in there. That is proper thick. Mosquito City. Whatever was this place. Right. Hello. Bizarre. And how is it closed down? It's been abandoned. It's a kid's school or hospital, definitely. Okay. Well, that's enough of that. Let's see what else. I'm looking, I'm now looking to have some breakfast. See if I can find somewhere half decent to eat. That's on the agenda. After, I'm still having a. Oh man, quite a stink in there. Oh mate, with all the mould and whatever. So definitely a kid's hospital or school. Definitely. Whoa, man, that's rank. Mm. Right, I'm out of here. Check out this wood. A little bit of wood. This is proper. A great big tabletop there. 
I had to stop just riding along this road on my next destination <laughs> look at that man I just saw saw I just saw these bits of wood aha <laughs> oh, I did man look at them but there's like it's a few businesses I don't know if it's all one it, can I come in ah okay look no okay man oh man look look at this wood man look at this wood that is nowhere near cheap <laughs> oh man that is nowhere near cheap oh wow look at these two bits here look <laughs> whoa those in the house on the wall it's a doorway, <laughs> so I can get through with me horse. <laughs> so you call a bishop door, man. And what they're doing, oh mate, is awesome. Oh God, look the stuff you could do with this wood. Oh man, look at the colours. <laughs> that's all rough sanded. That's all got to be. That's all got to be treated. Yeah, that, that's just where they cut it. Oh, that's all got to be sanded up for days, I should think. Man, what a cool spot. You can hear the old sanders going away. <laughs> it's wicked bits of wood. There's more, I'll just show you a few more. Look, the whole street. It's full of them. Bits, huge bits. I mean, look at that. Uh, that's just an awesome piece of wood. Go ahead, show them. Kapum, Kapum Cab. That is absolutely awesome. And there's another one. You alright, buddy? You good? Yeah. Dogs, look. They're everywhere. Unique, unique. 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 <laughs> Kaboom. This is so good, my friend. It's really good. No need, sir. No need. No need? Okay. Don't have to take my shoes off. See, this is... Oh, mate, look at that. It's the sort of stuff you'd get in Habitat. <laughs> Remember Habitat? Whoa. It's a little bit dark. But we'll just have a look. It's awesome stuff, man. A lot of people working here. Oh, look. <laughs> 25 grand for that. How much is that? 25,000 baht. That's only 50, 50 odd quid. Is it? Or is it 500? That's 500 quid. <laughs> I, ain't got the, I ain't got the budget for this place. That's how much that is. And that one there, that's a... If that's 45,000, that's a grand. For that one. A little bit, a little bit more expensive. It's already kept. Yeah, they're not cheap by anybody's pocket but oh man that's so cool right let's get out of here <laughs> lovely bits of wood kapum cap kapum thank you oh really cool oh man that's fairly smooth, I'd want that a bit smoother. <laughs> okay, cool, something different. Right, and I parked my bike up there. Bansakit is the next place, it's about nine kilometers. So you'll catch me there. The sun is coming out, but we, we just had a little rain show that I managed to miss, so I'll keep, I'll keep vlogging along. It's 
a beach, public access to a beach just over there to my right, opposite this temple. Ban. Africa. <laughs> I'll show you. There's the temple. And there's welcome to Ban Mac Ham Public Beach. We're in. Okay, easy, easy, easy on that front brake. Whoa! Fucking hell. I did injure myself when I slipped over. Look, grazed my knee. And what I do, I did, I did my wrist in as well a bit. Got grazed up, man. It's not good falling over. I've got to learn, because I do fall over quite a bit. But it is having these slippery flip-flops on. Now that said public beach, right? But there, there was another one up there. But I, I, I didn't because it was, well, it was worse than this. So I'm pointless filming it. So that's your public beach. I'm not, you know. <laughs> it's not much of a beach. The tide must be well in. But also, I don't know. Oh, he's, he's lazy. He's not cleaned his beach. This is probably the case all the way up here. I don't know how public the beach is. I don't know how far you're going to get up it. The sea doesn't look very enticing at all. It's very murky. So I think we need a good few days or a week away from the rain oh man all this shit look on the public beach it's because all these people they just don't they just don't get it man they really don't well, enough of that beach what a beach that was a when a beach not really oh man oh we're getting low on the battery now so Still need to find something to eat. Well, I come inland. I saw a sign on the side of the road that said waterfall. Fucking love a waterfall. I do. So, I took a few twists and turns and I've come, ended up at this place. Which tells me, <laughs> back in the day, there was a zip line here i'll look for that in a minute there's a restaurant there but it's all locked up closed down run down ah but look oh man that whoa oh that's pretty cool <laughs> oh we're good yes i got my safety boots on i fell over once today <laughs> Let's see if we'll be okay. Oh man, and the sun is coming through. That looks tropical, man. That look, that do, I like it. I might even take a photograph. I haven't taken a photograph for a few days of anything. Oh man. Right. <laughs> what a cool spot. The coolest spot yet. Let's say the beaches have been disappointing because we've had lots of rain that's obviously made this waterfall as active as it is it's just up there a bit more i don't know i won't i won't get far that way <gasps> oh fuck i thought i saw a snake oh that would do me but yeah not a bad little waterfall something and the sun is getting strong when that comes out oh, I'm gonna keep my hat on because coconuts are falling all around us <laughs> they are I'll show you on the way back because of the wind or whatever yeah, there's a whole load of um, crap laying about everywhere well, I'm going up there. Uh, 
I put the camera on because I don't like leaving stuff in the... I just don't like leaving stuff about whether or not people are here or whatever. Well, I don't like it. <laughs> Can't leave anything about where I'm from. Nothing. I guess that's what it is. It's cool from up here. That sun's just gone in, so I reckon we're due another storm. Equipment checklist map. What is this bungee? Bungee. Zip line all about. Oh, that's a, oh, it is. It's proper lock. That looks like you would go up there. That lock. Oh, fucking hell. That lock is it? That isn't. It's just done up. I'm going to leave that undone. <laughs> hey. Let's see what was up here. Skyhawk Adventures. Abandoned. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. These are cool. That's a cool use of plastic. Oh man. These hooks. Steps. Oh, this. Blue pipes. Oh man, let's have a walk on the decking. Still pretty solid. You see little bits of the waterfall through there. Oh, man. So there's a track here. I'll just see how far it goes. I want to see a little bit more of the waterfall before we come out. Oh, oh man. Half of them got up there. Let's take the low road. Oh man. Yeah, look, all these blue pipes, they have water pipes for pumping the water from the pools at the bottom up at the top. Oh man. Bugs and stuff everywhere. Oh man, look. That is cool. That is a wicked trek. The jungle. <laughs> Be careful where I put my feet. Right, I'll put you on hold because the battery's running down. Oh, this will be, well it is, it's the vlog, it's what it is. <laughs> I'm going to go much further if I can go up there a little bit more. Well, oh man, you can walk right up. Not a bad little walk. Whoa, whoa. Oh man. Oh, how cool is that? I can't see any zip lines. They're all gone, but that is a cool little waterfall. And that is me now going back <laughs> over this fucking horrible little bridge. That is horrible. You see it? Right, look, you've got to get <laughs> you, you're on the middle. Otherwise, it's like, oh. Oh, I didn't like it. Right, that was me. That's as far as I'm going up the waterfall. Not a bad little waterfall. And if I could say, not a bad little hike, really. Say so something, something different. Whew. Right. And they're going to go and find some breakfast. Okay, breakfast. I am now about to have. But before I do. This place where I'm at, I'm not sure what it's called. 
but the street that I just bought me. <laughs> me love me. So a little bit long, but I will shorten them. I'll get them right. And that's how I rub them. Make me all calm and chilled, isn't it? That's what they're for, isn't it? Love beads, man. Love, love. <laughs> so anyway, this street, it's really cool. It's got loads of little boutiques on it. I don't know the area, but if you come down this road, that down there is the harbour where you catch the ferries to Donansk. Dansk, I think. I'll have to do a little bit of work online and I'll put something in the headings titles right here but um i've come in the restaurant guess what i'm having for breakfast oh, it's really dark light is is everything man i'm having pack of pal <laughs> that looks that looks proper but i've also ordered morning glory So what is this lady's pack of power like in this restaurant on the corner? Oh yeah. Leo? Small Leo? Leo? No, Leo. You have? Small. Small. Wow. I did ask if I wanted it spicy or, or nib, nib, nib noy, little bit. I said little bit. That's pretty good. I was hoping the morning glory come with it, together. They go really well together. Oh wait, I've ordered me Leo. So I'm... <clears throat> oh man, fucking proper hot. Oh. I'm stalling so I can get a Leo and give you all the big cheers. While I'm stalling, I was reading the comments, so I'll give you some idea of how long I am behind. This is my... Here we go, Pack, here we go, we've got it, that's what we want. Morning glory, and the Leo, full, full order. Back is gonna go, food's really good. I had no internet for two days. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> oh mate. Oh, and that is awesome and I do mean proper cheers and for now au revoir